just what, what, what was this like? First, you know, double overtime, zero zero game. I mean, how nerve wracking was it out there? I just felt like anything could happen. We were evenly matched. It was a great game, and I knew that I wouldn't be satisfied if we didn't win. And it was just like every second, I just wanted to like burst out crying. Just like I was so excited and nervous at the same time. Take us through the goal, so to describe it for us. Um, it was the clock ran out, and we had to play out the corner. Um, my teammate Warren passed it to me to the right, and I like took a second, and then I just hit it in, and it went hit the backboard. What do you feel like? I just felt like everything was like complete. Like I'm the happiest person in the world right now. Why did you take a second? Why didn't you just hit it right away? I didn't know if I should pass it, if I should like take a backswing or just hit it in like lightly, see if someone else can tap it in. But then I realized that it's wide open and I can just shoot it. What does it mean? What I mean, no time left on the clock. You know you're going to penalty strokes after that. What does it mean to win in that sort of fashion? I think that's the best. I think it's the most exciting. It's definitely the most fun. You can look back and be like, yeah, we won in double overtime back-to-back -back state championships. A lot of Ocean City teams have won state championships, but they probably haven't won a game as dramatic as this. No, what does that mean to you guys? Um, it's just another part of Ocean City history, and it's a great thing to be a part of. What was the mood of the team? Rachel gets stopped on the stroke there. You know, I'm sure at that point you're anticipating, hey, maybe we can win it right here. How did you guys bounce back from that? We knew that there were going to be other opportunities. Um, strokes have never been our, like, best part of our, like, what we've been good at. Um, we're definitely better at the game, playing the game, not the strokes. So we knew that it's not the end of the world. We've missed strokes before, and we've been fine. Yeah, when you decided to shoot hard, did you realize there that you, you might as well because you had, there was no time left. You had, you know, you had to take your shot right there. Yeah, um, that was just instinct, and it just worked out in the end. And after the year you've had, the early losses and stuff, to come back and be state champions, just the whole journey, what does that mean to you? It's the best thing in the world because, you know, last year everything seemed like it came to us easy. We did it, and, like, we didn't really struggle at all. And this year there were ups and downs, and now we can look back and say that we've like help like we use that struggle to help us become a better team and we've accomplished everything we wanted to accomplish. All right, thank you very